You're a racist. What? what? You don't like me because you think that I am an Arab. What? No. What are you talking about? Excuse like me. That. Wait. That oh, wait, boy. I, I, I am his mentor. I am so proud of you. What do you mean, a mentor? Don't worry about that. Okay, so what you got for him? James De Santa. Some kid. He is already late on his payments, and I have this bad feeling that he will do more damage to the car than we can get back from him in the exorbitant interest rate payments. Huh? Just go and get it. The house is on um, uh, Hampstead uh, off Eclipse. It's an SUV. Huh? Some Rockford Hills daddy's boy nonsense. Don't worry about it. Try to bring the car back in good condition, huh? I got you. Don't worry about it. It's so good to see you, my boy. Hey, good luck in uh, law school, huh? <gasps> Where are we at? Uh, financing? The financing, it seems like a shitty deal. Proposition 208 and legalize medical cocaine. Change your mind? When I discover that you betray me, perhaps. I hear you took the bike for yourself, my employee of the month. Listen, man, me and Omar was gonna get that back to you, dog. Oh, I am sure. You will get this car off the daddy's boy, and then we talk. Insurance papers say they have a locked garage, so you... You'll need to gain access from inside the house. Man, it's never easy with you, is it, Simi? Do not talk to me about easy, you thief! Lo que esta ciudad necesita es más... Gaper, bitch! Fucking homo, you're dead! Dead! He said I had a massive... Jimmy called me a bitch! He tried to knife attack me? No one creeps on the chain dog, my niggas! Santa, a real pro. Well, you're a great student. Now just loosen up those hips. Okay, like this? Yeah, loosen them up there. Hey, Simeon, I got the ride, man. I'm coming back. Yeah, if you actually bring the repossession to me this time, I can have it back out on the street before the day is done. That's a 9mm semi-automatic pushed against your skull. Huh? Well, look around. You just keep driving where you're going. Hey, come on, man. This was a repo job. Guy was behind on the fucking note. Unlikely. The 
babysitter and my son just got the car. And looking at the way you're going about this, my guess, you're working a credit fraud. A credit fraud? Be serious, dude. I just worked the fucking repo. I appreciate it, kid. Follows orders without taking responsibility. Yeah, maybe one day we'll have a beer, and I'll explain how the world really works. Who gives you the slip? A car. What are you, a fucking idiot? A car dealer, dog, by the name of Simeon Terry. So this businessman, he looked legit to you? Look, man, it's just between him and your fucking son. Don't worry. Me and Mr. Yatarian, we'll work this out. Are we all from the same tree? Why is science so confusing? How many women can I lie with? Can I pay money and have all of life's answers? Yes. 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 We speak a whole 60 languages. Hey, man, it's Jess up here. Okay. Stop the car. Pull up. That the place? Yeah, this the place, man. Whoa. Drive into it. Right through the fucking window. And fast. Or I'll put two rounds in the back of your skull and do it myself. Man, you can't be for real. I look like a fucking joke to you. Man, fuck my life, man. Fuck it. Ram it already. Mr. Sammy, it's not exactly how it looks. I always trump big for a job well done. Now get out of here, kid. You motherfucker! I won't be- You think you could take me for a ride? You think you could take my family for a ride? You recognize this car? Huh? Does it look like it's worth five grand a month to you? You fucking racist! I'm telling you something. This thing's gonna need some serious body work for it. It's worth five grand a month. Ah, he agreed to financing I have his signature. Yeah. Did he agree to have some punk break into my fucking house? I I don't know. That kid might be a fucking idiot. But you are a fraudulent scumbag piece of shit. Ugh. Don't make me have to come back here. Get gone, boy. Where I'm from, it's the same old shit. Shots. When you're down with the wind, niggas dying every day, but that's a black thing. You eat yourself dope for your gang, man. You got the biggest heart in the clique, man. You did a murder. 
And now you're a hit man. All your homies trying to tell you that ain't cool. Playing shoot 'em up like a fucking fool. But you's a gangster, one they can't destroy. Don't even give a fuck about your boys. You go for self. You wanna be on top? Fucked around and now your brother shot. Homie. Hey, how about we kick it? All right, fool, for sure. But I got a lot of shit going on right now, so I understand if you need to cancel, you know, just hit me up. On my way. had a gun in my head. No loyalty, no integrity. You should have taken the bullet. My business, my totally legitimate business. You are fucked, my boy. Fucked. Hey, don't make me commit a 187, homie. Ah! Oh, hey, oh, shit. What is the number? I didn't answer. What is the number? Damn! Oh, oh shit! Man, I'm sorry, fool. Good evening. 
Come by for that drink you offered, that's all. I wasn't really serious about that. What? Uh, you're here, whatever. Sit. You're not gonna rob me again. Man, I never robbed you. That was just a repossession. Okay. You call it whatever you want to call it. I really don't care. What can I do for you? Shit, I just came by to see if there's something I can help you with. I see you doing well for yourself. Look. I'm retired. Ain't you a bit young for the pipe, slippers, and staring at a fucking sunset? You know, I've been in this game for a lot of years, and I got out alive. That makes me the right age. <clears throat> you look like a good kid, but if you want my advice, you give the shit up. You work hard, screw over everybody that you love. Hurt, rob, kill indiscriminately, and maybe just maybe, if you're lucky, you become a three-bit gangster. It's bullshit. Go to college. Then you can rip people off and get paid for it. It's called capitalism. Hmm. So what I saw the other day was like when a corpse briefly reanimates itself and terrorizes everyone, right? What you saw the other day was a guy dealing with pests. I guess I never saw myself as just a fucking pest. Well. And today's lesson's all about humility. Tomorrow we'll try a training montage. A training what? Nothing. I was just lost in an 80s movie fantasy. <laughs> yeah, I can see you spend a lot of time there. Yeah, as much as I can. So that's why you're here in Vinewood then, right? Maybe I'm here because I'm just an idiot. Who thinks that imported palm trees are a good substitute for not really knowing what the fuck you're doing on this earth. Jesus, man. You a good time, you know that. I tell you what, <sighs> least I can do is buy you that beer. There's a little bar I like. <sighs> it's not too far from here. Let's go. All right, man. I'm following you. We're taking my wife's car. Hey, Jim. I'm going for a drink. With... Dad, shit! I mean, our boat going down the Western Highway. It's it's been stolen. What? The yacht's been stolen? I, I was trying to sell it. I know you didn't want it sold, but I need money, and they don't want to buy it. They just want to take it. I'm hiding in the head. You're insane. All right, I'm coming for my boat. All righty, then. Change of plans. My darling boy is in trouble. Hey, I'll help you out. <laughs> 